Professor Freddy Trello here in Miami Lakes, Florida, here to teach you police tip of the week. Um, here we go. So, front bear hug over the arms. Okay, we're gonna do it first speed, fast speed, and then I'm gonna walk you through it as quickly as I can. Go. Start turning over, start turning over. Let your know. Hands behind your back. Click, click. What do we do there? Okay, so first thing I need to do, what we're discussing here is a bear hug over the arms. So he's bear hugging me. The first thing I need to do is I need to bring my elbows inside on, my, on me, on your torso, so that he can't pull you any closer than your bones, than your hands are allowed. So he's bear hugging me. Boom, I'm dropping him base and my hands are going inside. My hands immediately go into his waist. From here, he can try to pull as much as he can. It's not gonna work, but I'm not gonna stay here. From here, I'm gonna shift to the side. My front hand's gonna go to the back. And now this leg here is gonna go straight across and I'm just sitting straight down. Look, he goes straight down. Okay, straight down. From here, I'm gonna scissor my legs to, as I turn to my knees. He's gonna start turning. As he starts turning, I'm gonna secure a seatbelt here, over, over. And I'm gonna bring this leg over. It's gonna stop him. It's gonna slow him down from going over here. From here, this position here, I'm gonna secure this wrist, okay? Step over, bring this knee over. Now, I'm having, Complete control, He's, he can't go anywhere here. So long as I keep this glued to my chest, he has nowhere to go. I'm gonna bring this leg over here, high up here. Not down here in his face, high up here. Now from here, I'm gonna start ordering him. Start turning down, sir, start turning down. Now from here, I transition here to here. Chest to the back of this arm. Knee to the ground, because you gotta give him space to turn over. Do you have the hand behind your back? Or the hand behind your back? Now I got him here in a position here where I can start taking out your handcuffs and placing them in handcuffs, okay? One last time, real slow motion. Bear hug, one, two, three, this is easy. As he starts to turn, I'm anticipating that. Lock, foot over, secure. Now from here, foot over here. Bring the hand around the neck. This knee way up here, away from him. Okay, now from here to your chest, start ordering him. Roll down, sir, roll down, roll down. Knee goes to the ground. Secure. You have total control here. Okay, that's a, that's a front bear hug over the arms. A little bit about me, because last time I did a video, some people were, who is this guy? Well, been a cop 25 years. Out of those 25 years down here in Miami, 24 of those years I've been doing training jujitsu. Okay, so SWAT guy, detective, uh, crimes uh, robbery detective guy, uh, defensive tactics instructor for a 3,000 man department. So I don't claim to know everything, but what I do know, I know it well. And there's a lot of variables to the, to the moves that I'm teaching. A lot of what ifs. These moves are specifically, I'm teaching these moves for those guys out there that may not have the time, may be living in a place where they don't have the resources uh, that, that we have in our bigger cities. These moves are for you, okay? Of course, there's other things you can do, but what I'm giving you is a little blueprint. If you have no idea how to get out of something like this and you get put in this position, now you, can, you have something to go with. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll be back next week with uh, next week's uh, tip of the, uh, of the week. Make sure to subscribe and follow me on uh, YouTube. Awesome.